Hey, Cam. Ah! What are you doing on the go? Shh. She might hear us. Don't worry, Kathleen. Shh. Kathleen's not here. Are you sure? I've been here for hours. I haven't seen. Wait, you haven't seen her either? Not even online. She hasn't accosted anybody with index cards yet. No, and I haven't seen a combat step flowchart since Hour of Devastation. You know, neither have I. Something's not right here. I know. The pre-release is in a couple of days. Normally by now, Kathleen would be yelling at us to internalize the strategies and learn what the cards do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Get in, losers. We're going dino hunting. Get in. Get in. Get in where? We are in. Don't argue with me, James. Figures of speech aren't going to save you against our reptilian overlords. We're going outside. No, 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 mercy. No, no, please, 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 please. I beg you. I beg you. Anything but this. No, not outside. It's where the people are. Okay. Heads up, James. Do not... James? Guys? It's too late. They're gone. But their noble sacrifice will live on in our hearts. Are they dead? No, just outside. They were so brave. Now, you know why you're all here. Because we're not as good at hiding as Graham and Paul are? How'd you get roped into this? She knocked on my door. Why on earth would you answer? It might have been the mail. Do you normally just answer the door when somebody knocks? Do you not? We are here to take down the Ixalan pre-release. I mean, I'd be happy with just going three and two. And after reading the full spoiler, I am pretty sure the dinosaurs are going to be the dominant tribe, especially in a slower format like Sealed. What about vampires? Or the pirates? Or the merfolk? They can run into a 9-9 dinosaur. They're not all 9-9s. Okay, then they can run into the 4-4 that can block two creatures at once. Those are all just big dumb dorks, though. Except for the 6-6 with Trample. Did I mention all of these are at common? All right, all right, I'll look at the flashcards. No, the time for index cards is over. If we want to win, we need to embrace our inner predators. We have to learn to think like dinosaurs. Cameron, you're a green dinosaur. Green? Alex, you're a red dinosaur. Sick! I think? James, you're a white dinosaur. They're white dinosaurs? Yes, many of them fly. Wait, if I'm a flying dinosaur, wouldn't I be a pterosaur? Ah! Hey, Kathleen, are you a multicolored dinosaur? There are multicolored dinosaurs? Rad! I need to build a dinosaur commander deck. Gishoth's son's avatar is so cool. 7 6, trample vigilance haste, and just puts more dinosaurs into play. Are you just ignoring Admiral Beckett Brass? She's a pirate lord, she costs half as much, and she can steal almost anything. She is a far superior commander for a way better tribe. Whoa, 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 hold, hold up, hold up. First, no. Second, how on earth are pirates better than dinosaurs? I mean, I don't have all afternoon to explain it to you, but briefly, there are more pirates than dinosaurs in Ixalan, there are more pirates in magic as a whole, Dinosaurs are Johnny-come-latelys. What? Dude, they've had dinosaurs forever. There were Dominarian dinosaurs. And they even retconned a bunch of the old lizards to be dinosaurs now, and some of them are good. I'm looking at Gatherer right now, and look, Fungasaur was in Alpha. But that- Alpha. That's literally as OD as you can get. OD means original dinosaur. A dinosaur tribal deck would be far superior to a pirate tribal deck. I disagree.
Jane. Bleh. Can I have your last nug? No. Oh, being a dinosaur sucks. Uh huh. And that's why a dinosaur deck running a green ramp package, including Omnath, Azusa, and Nylea, would stomp the crap out of your puny pirates. Well, that hardly seems creative. I ramp, I cast dudes, I turn them sideways. I don't need to be creative. That's how you win games of magic. <laughs> also, I could put Oversoul of Dusk in the deck, and that has protection from blue, black, and red, i.e. all the colors pirates come in, QED, I win. Sure, sure, dinosaurs might beat pirates in terms of raw power and toughness, but pirates have a strategic advantage. Their affinity for treasure. Uh-huh. Treasure is an artifact. Uh-huh. And artifacts are some of the most powerful cards in Magic. All I need to do is play a Microsynth Lattice and everything is an artifact. Now suddenly, my Deadeye Plunderers are the most powerful cards on the board. And your dinosaurs don't stand a chance. That's one creature. Ah, but I can use Cranial Plating to make any pirate as dangerous as the Deadeye Plunderers. And then all I have to do is resolve Disciple of the Vault, and it doesn't matter if my pirates get eaten by dinosaurs. They'll still do damage to you. That seems super janky. That's nothing compared to what I could do with a Bludgeon Brawl, a Volshock Battlemaster, and Murderous Spoils. I don't know what any of those cards do. Turns all your lands and enchantments into equipment, and then steals them. Try to cast your H-Drop then. Ha! There is no way that works before you take lethal raptor damage. There's only one way to find out. We must do battle. But Ixalan isn't out, so we can't. Also, we need to fight the decks multiple times to account for variants. One or even five times just wouldn't be scientific. I mean, we are literally arguing about who would win in a fight, dinosaurs or pirates. Give me your deck list in 15 minutes with the most powerful computer in the office. But I'm using my phone. Hey Cam, how's it going? In touch with your inner dinosaur yet? Uh, no, no. But I do think we are being watched. Yeah, by like birds and voles and whatever else lives in the woods. Or, or bears or cougars or, uh, I don't know, mus muskrats? Do muskrats live in this part of the world? If they do, they're watching us. <gasps> uh... We, we should go. What about Alex and James? Survival of the fittest! Ah! I think I've decided that I don't like being outside very much. No, neither do I. Wait, what? This is your idea. Why are we even here? I just wanted to suggest something that was so unpleasant. The next time I said, hey, let's all get together to bone up for the pre-release, that you guys just wouldn't immediately say no. Okay. Wow. First off, that's a seriously long game you're playing. Kudos. B. I can't believe you dragged us all the way out here for no reason whatsoever. That's BM. And four, I hope you're really happy that we're all gonna get eaten alive by muskrats. And if you just wanted to read flashcards like a normal person, none of this would have happened. What kind of normal person wants to read flashcards? Ah! 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 Ah, why do I smell french fries? Hi. What the hell? Where did you get an inflatable dinosaur costume? And more importantly, where'd you get those fries? Halloween pop-up shop. We've been like 200 meters away from a mini mall this whole time. What? You guys were supposed to hunt and or gather food. What food were we even supposed to find? I don't know, like woods food. I can see now why you have been wandering around the bushes behind a mini mall all day. Ah, uh, no one's learned anything. All we've done is waste an entire day of pre-release prep time. Not true. I learned that there's a Halloween pop-up store at the mini mall. And I learned something too. I got bored and started reading the visual spoiler. Did you know Vrask is in this set? What? Vrask is in this set? This set's awesome! Okay, I programmed an algorithm that will fight our two commander decks for us. It seems like it's sort of taking the fun out of the whole thing. Do you want to play 10,000 games of Commander to settle this debate? I mean, kinda. I'm gonna run the algorithm now. Okay. And the best Commander deck is a 
Tishana Voice of Thunder Merfolk deck. Oh. Huh. Let's never speak of this again. Agreed. Hey, anyone want to fight my new Tashana Commander deck? No, no, no. no, no. Mm -mm. <laughs>